Remember the times during quarantine when salons and barber shops were closed and a lot of people, well, they tried to style their own hair. We all did it, let's be honest. <laughs> well, to those who might now have a permanent bad hair day, here's someone who could help out. Our Christina Benzels introduces us to a local barber who literally rolled with the changes. The lakefront. Got a nice view of the... The lighthouse and a museum the civil war museum the scenic views you'll get at a kenosha barber shop it's a nice spot to just cut and relax but unlike the hair that comes in come on in alex this shop isn't rooted anywhere i always thought it'd be cool to make a mobile barber shop mitchell thomas has been a barber in the kenosha racine area for seven years when the pandemic hit it was anything but a dead end for business. It was the perfect time to buy a party bus. <laughs> the 13-seater. It's a Ford Tesco. Transformed into what's now known as the Blacktop Barbershop. This luxury cruiser offering a private, safe, and convenient setting in parking spots around southeastern Wisconsin. I think it's a lot more stress-free that I built this bus and I'm doing a mobile shop that it's just you and the person. While the decision to make a mobile barber shop was clear cut, Thomas wasn't sure who'd right, roll right, with uh, him. It's kind of nerve wracking because you don't know if people are going to find you. But business didn't fade. It flourished. Kind of a full day. I gave him all my support. I mean, the man is a hard working individual. His solo barber chair. How the Yankees doing? Sitting all walks of life as Thomas stays busy with both new and old clients. You see it, you're like, wow. like. He is trying his best just to make everybody else comfortable. The one on one appointments, personal interaction, many were forced to cut off due to COVID 19. It goes from sports to politics to anything, and it just feels great, you know? While it's only been a few months of operation, Thomas has hit the ground running. Just having support in the journey, it's, it keeps you humble and grateful. And as his business rolls on. Right now I'm definitely just content and happy just doing me. Not even a bad hair day can get in the way. In fact, he welcomes it. Thanks again, Alec. Reporting in Kenosha, Christina Van Zelst, Fox 6 News. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that looks awesome. Back to the shop myself for the first time today. It's been a while. It feels good to be back, right? If you're interested, you can find the barber shop at local businesses, churches, maybe community centers, or you can order a mobile visit. It's going to come right to you if you do that. If you'd like weekly updates on the location, you can follow Blacktop Barbershop on social media. If you'd like more information, just head over to our website. Fox6now.com.